Hey yo, what is up you guys? I am back for another video guys. I'm super excited and I'm super hungry and we're just gonna dig right in because I'm starving and I have tons of ranch from Jack in the Box. Jack in the Box is probably one of my favorite fast food restaurants. Look how many ranches I got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ranches you guys. We're gonna go ham. I love their buttermilk, their buttermilk house ranch sauce. Buttermilk house sauce, aka ranch. I got the number seven, because I love the number seven. It has bacon, it has cheese, the double cheese, like this one tastes so good with ranch. You guys. Got hot sauce. Tell you why you got hot sauce. You cannot go to Jack the Box without getting their tacos. I'm telling you guys, you cannot go to Jack in the Box without getting their crispy tacos. Probably the best fast food tacos in the game because I know that cars, I mean, a few other places have tacos, but. Jack in the Box tacos are the best. Also got... Hey, where are my curly fries? Oh, right here. Curly fries are right here. Got curly fries and regular fries because I haven't really... I haven't had curly fries in years. You guys, literally years. And I also got the bacon potato wedges. Bacon cheddar potato wedges. Oh, my lord. Steam. I asked for extra cheese. I didn't put extra cheese on there. Oh, you know, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna start off with that real, real, really quick. Thank you, Lord Father God, for blessing the food. Bless the food of God. Amen. Got a multitask around here. If you guys don't like messy eating, I'm just gonna go ham. I'm I'm hungry. Okay, so these are basically potato wedges with melted cheese on there with bacon bits. Ooh, that ranch is so good. God know that I wanted this. The Lord know that I wanted this so bad. Oh my gosh. Everything on the menu I eat with ranch. The tacos, the burgers, everything. Stack all of our wrenches here. We'll see how many we end up using. So how's everyone doing? Oh, that, oh, I don't think that I told you guys this story. This lady tried to hit and run me recently. I went to, to the mall. And this, oh, here, I'll tell you guys right now. Just that burger that was calling my name really quick. Mm. Mm -mm. My ranch is well.
earthquake. This is hypnotic. This is so hypnotic, you guys. Food is an addiction. Oh, it's not an addiction, but... Oh, some people it is. But, um... It's just so good. How can food... Be this good? Mmm... You're like, Steven, you're eating ranch with tacos. If you know Jack in the Box, and if you have a Jack in the Box near you, you know that their tacos with their ranch is fire. Mmm. Oh my God. Hypnotic poison. Two ranches down. See, we were, we're, we're blowing through these ranches. I love the ranch, you guys. All right, so story time. Promise, I'm gonna make this story as easy to understand as possible. Cause I know that I get, my mind is just gets discombobulated when, when I'm telling stories. So I don't, I don't know what's wrong with me, but I can never tell a story. Like my mind jumps, 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 jumps. But, wow. Very short story. Very, 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 very short. This lady is backing out. I'm at the mall. The whole parking lane, the whole parking aisle packed with cars. And there's no parking. So I'm like, I have to go to the end and go around and stuff like that. So I'm almost at the end. And I see this lady backing out, but she needs to stop because I have the right of way. She needs to look back and make sure there's no car before she just pulls up. She she sees my truck. And mind you, you guys know that I have a really high truck. My truck is lifted. And basically, if she hits my car truck, she's going to hit my tire because my truck's really high. And... She keeps pulling out. I'm like, this lady, like, she sees, and I'm still rolling. Like, I have my foot on the brake just, just in case she hits me. And then I see her break, okay? I'm like, okay, all right, cool. So she seen me, so she broke. I was like, all right, cool. So let me drive through. Then she steps on her gas, the reverse gas, and she bumps right into me. And she hits my passenger right front side. And then you feel like the whole car jolt. And I was like, what the stupid girl? I don't know if it was a guy or a girl at that time. She gets out of her car. Very, very aggressive. Hey, hey, hey. You good? You good or what? You good? 
I'm like, yeah, I'm good. Are you good? Like, if anything, like, you got hit, not me. Because, like, so, basically, so now we look at the damage. She looks at her, um, at her rear trunk. She looks at her, um, back of her car. Um, she looks at her trunk, or, yeah, like, like, her rear bumper. She saw, uh, hers is like, hers has like a dent. There's not a scratch on mine. Hers has, has a dent. She's like, are you good? Are you good? Um, I don't really have to, I don't, I, she said, I don't have time for all this. Are you good or what? My girl, like, what the hell's your problem? Are you good? You good? You good? That's all she kept saying. Oh yeah, I'm, 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 oh yeah, I'm good. I'm gonna chill out. She's like, she's like, ah, oh, all right, it's just a small little dent. I'm all, this is kind of sketchy. So she gets in her car and she's leaving. I'm like, oh damn, all right, you don't want to change insurances. You, you, you don't need my insurance. You don't need your insurance. All right, whatever. I just took a picture of her license plate. But like, like this girl like was aggressive. She backed into me, probably because she knew that it was her fault. The story is. It really wasn't a hit and run, but. What would you guys do? Would you guys still want to exchange stuff? I mean, there wasn't really any anything happened to mine, but just a little scratch. Just any scratch on the tire. So for those who've been asking for the Awa Chile video, it's finally out. If you guys missed the post or whatever, uh, the post with me and Vanessa that we did we filmed Awa Chile, it's finally out. Um, it was uploaded yesterday. And also, I'm going to be posting the recipe video very soon too. So if you want to see that recipe video, it's going to be up. We film like a two part series kind of. I don't think I needed that much ranch as well. Hey, you know what? The bread is kind of sweet. I, I never I never knew that the bread had a sweet. Yo, you guys, I'm so tired. I've been up for 24 hours. Have not had any sleep at all. Earlier in today, I was driving. And um, I was so freaking tired. My eyes could not, like, stay, like, I was trying to open them. And I think that you, if you get really, really tired, like sleep deprivation, I think that you're, um, I think they say that you can ho ho hallucinate, I think. And I was seeing like this witch in the, witch in the air. I think that was, I was just like thinking about like Halloween and stuff, but I was seeing like this witch flying in the air.
like on a broomstick. <laughs> you probably think I'm crazy. Like a witch on a broomstick. What is life, honestly, you guys? I was thinking about that the other day. Live life to the fullest, you guys. Don't care about what anyone thinks about you. Do you? Because at the end of the day, we're all human. We're all gonna die one day. Like, legit, we're all gonna die one day. Every single one of us, we're not gonna live forever. And who cares about what this person says about you, this, this person? Because at the end of the day, One day we're all gonna be six feet under, and who's gonna remember? Like, who's gonna care? You know? Everybody has their own lives to worry about. And I was saying that because I have a I have a lot of younger people that DM me on Instagram, and they always say, hey, "Steven, I really want to start a YouTube channel, but I'm scared about what people are gonna think about me." That's like the most craziest thing that. That I feel like this generation, that's the first thing that comes to the mind is what are people going to think about me? And you shouldn't care about what anyone thinks about you because at the end of the day, you're in your own body, you're in your own life. As long as you know who you are, you know where you're going, that's all that matters. Everybody else can say a lot of bad things about you, but if you know who you are and you know what you want, you know where you're going, that's all that matters. So so that's, that's my little um, motivation, my little encouragement for today so if anybody needed to hear that yeah so but yeah guys i hope you guys like this video um i was just a little more chill today well kind of until i just throw up that food but yeah i'm like so 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 freaking stuff now what did i actually eat burger these wedges you guys if you guys go to jack in the box you guys gotta get the freaking potato wedges with cheese ask for extra cheese my ex-girlfriend, she said she, she used to get extra cheese. And she actually put me on to them. Like, she used to go to Jack in the Box all the time. I'm like, oh, you get the potato wedges? Like, like that? Like, it's like, a, it's like very, like, she has to get them every time she, she, she goes. And she ordered extra cheese. I'm like, oh, I, I, I didn't know you get extra cheese. So she put me on to that. So if you're watching this, you know who you are. But hey, guys, I hope you liked the video. Give this video a thumbs up. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video, all right? Peace.